We are very thankful to the government of Kenya for making this bridge because it has really helped Mombasa economically and also the people who live uh, around here. This bridge is a bridge. The bridge is a bridge, but the bridge is a bridge. The bridge is a bridge, but the bridge is a bridge. The bridge is a bridge. Mombasa has reclaimed its island status at the Kenya's coast following the completion and opening of the Makupa Bridge four months ago. Join me in today's episode as I do a follow-up of Makupa Bridge. I want to engage with the residents so that we can know the impact of this bridge to their livelihood. If you're new here, my name is Dolphin254. I do infrastructural development videos, city tours, and real estate. If those are the kind of content you want to see here on YouTube, consider subscribing. Give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to share it to your friends. So stay tuned. Let me show you around. The other time I was here, the traffic around this place was so crazy. So currently this is what's happening. No more traffic. This is what I'm able to see. But uh, for you to understand more about uh, what I'm talking about, I just wanna do an interview to random residents. Like I want them to share with you what they think about uh, the expansion of this road, the construction of Makupa Bridge. So let's go. <laughs> We're going to make a tour of the whole stretch. On the way as we go, to Kikutana na watu tutawafanyisha interview. Because vile uh, nimewambia, I've told you that the traffic flow is moving. I think you can see for yourself. But it's even better if you can hear from the horse's mouth. So through an interview, this is going to be very possible. So let's go and get to hear from them. So as you can see, I'm here with Mose. He is a YouTuber from Mombasa. He has more information about the bridge. So we are going to do this video together. So stay tuned, guys. Uh, so we are just going to walk you around this bridge, mm -hmm. show you how it looks like. We have a lot in store for you. We are yeah, also yeah, going yeah. to update you yeah. on the current updates of the Mcheza Bridge. Yeah. It is still under construction. I yeah. did a video about it. Uh, the last time I was in Mombasa, so I'm just here just to give you an update. You can see for yourself the, the bridge looks awesome. Yeah. You can see vehicles are passing here so fast. And I'm the moving old fast. road was also demolished. Yeah, the old road was somewhere here. Yeah, it was here. Yeah, so so this place mm. they'll bridge a rail they they'll they, they built a railway. A railway. Yeah, it would be like a, a it would be like a, a commuter railway from Mombasa town to uh. Miritini. Oh, to Miritini where we, we, we bought the, the SGR. This, yeah, yeah, so it will be a commuter railway. You can see railway. the beautiful signage. Yeah. Everything has been done well. I love the fact that uh, yeah. the road was well marked. Yeah. Street lights are up there. You can see them, guys. They're so beautiful. Yeah. Signages have been done. They did a good job. Yeah. It's it is 80 kilometers per hour. Yeah, just like Nairobi Expressway. Yeah, so you can see for yourself. Wow, I'm really loving these guys. Yeah, so I'm loving this. I had to come all the way from Nairobi just to update you about this because yeah. most of my viewers have been asking me, Dolphin, we need updates. And yeah. Kamakawaida here, your wish is always yeah, my you can see how beautiful this bridge. Let me show them yeah. from this side. Yeah. Oh, let's go up there. Just to see. So imagine yeah. how what they decided to separate a place for pedestrians which yeah, is a so good thing you know most roads are built here in kenya unapata pedestrians are sharing the same roads with with, uh, with, with vehicles, vehicles yeah. which is not a good thing 
Yeah. But this one at least it has improved safety. Yeah. You can see to Natambia Bila was you are at Wesley Gongwa. Yeah, at Wesley Gongwa. I'm not a Nagani. So you can see this place is uh, now it is safe. It is safe. I remember some, some years back when the, when, when the, when the, when the Kose was still uh, in use, mm. this place was so insecure. You couldn't even pass here at 7 pm. Mm. But now the street lights have been uh, installed. Place, yeah. It is it is safe. Uh, they're trying to build a, a rail bridge there. Oh, okay. So one, once they built it, then they demolished demolish this place so that to allow what, all the yeah, to, to connect cross to the to connect to the other side. Yeah. So Mombasa will fully be an island. Yeah. So uh, uh, once the, the the bridge is completed, the rail bridge. Oh. Yeah. So guys, you can see the construction being stalled. Like yeah. many of you think. Unajua watu wanamiliza, ah, yeah. constructions inaendelea mazili stop. Oh. You can see men are still at work, yeah. meaning that this thing is going to be completed like soon. Yeah, construction so, is still going on. Mombasa itakuwa fully an island. Yeah. So, washa tutuwa onyeshe. If you already love this video, msinimine likes. Like, 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 share, share, share. And don't forget to subscribe to Dolphin254. Na mkisa hau bradangu wata. And I don't yeah. know TV. <laughs> yeah, in fact, it's for free. Yeah, for free, imagine. <laughs> to now, yeah. is it for free? Yeah. At the comfort of your coach. One, two, three, four. Habari? Mm -hmm. Mina Dolphin. Mina ito Smith. Mm -hmm. Aha. Kona Simanzi Bridge. Lakini because of nearest police station namba kona Makupa. Tazo tuengo na idio na Makupa. Lakini kona Simanzi Bridge. Nianza kujengwa. Pata ni nianza kujengwa wenyali la zika sana ama wenyali umia sana ni mayuts. Mayuts. Sana sana sisi kama wenyali na lala pachi. Before ni kwa na lala apu lakini right now na fanya kazi na. Mulikuwa na lala wapi? Kwa na lala pande ile kamu kona. Pande chini ya bridge. Hai kuna pali hapo naweza nikakupeleka nikakuonyesha upige picha. Sasa nilikapo kwa muda ndio tukaka form group ya seven people. Aha. Bapo mimi ndio chama yao. Kwa stage hapa. Hii bridge tangejengwa. Barabara iko sawa kijakata lakini kifo bado ni mingi. Vifo. Vifo bado ni mingi kwa sababu China nadai kuwa hapa ukigongwa ama ukipata jali wewe mtu pedestrian mwenye anatembea ama uko na pikipiki hautalipwa chochote ukigongwa kigongwa ulipi chochote ama wewe binadamu ukigongwa hakuna chenye unalipwa ambapo inasemekana pikipiki binadamu wafaa kutembea na juu hawafai kutembea kwa hii barabara kwa sababu kutoka makupa round about mpaka ukosee bridge upite kabisa ni 80 km ambapo driver ameruhusiwa kuendesha gari na umaide umaide yani ujuzi yake yote bila naweza ambapo akikugonga kuna kulepa na isitoshe pia hii bridge ikijengwa mayut sisi wenye tulikuwa tunalala hapa chini tumepitia wengi wamekufa wengi wa nini hasa imesababisha vipo hasa kenyele unajua Mombasa mostly kitu yenye na tonga mayut sinje sana sana ni scrap ambapo wana deal na metal chuma copper brass aluminium hazina pata materials mingi zenye china jana walikuwa natumia materials zao mingi zilikuwa ni chuma na brush na copper. Sasa mm -hmm. ikawa wengi wa ma street supervisors, yani mm -hmm. ma street boys wenye walikuwa nalala hapa, mm -hmm. wengi hawakuwa na kazi. Eh. Yeah. Unaona by that time kulikuwa na corona, lockdown. Mm -hmm. Sasa hawangepata pesa ya haraka. Sasa mm -hmm. ikawa changamoto kwao kuiba chuma hizo hao watu. Nimefanya uh -huh. wengi wakauao. Oh. Ongeza kwanza serikali kuwa. Mm. Chini za hizi ma bridge. Eh. Yeah. Kuna wenye wanalala ambapo mm. wana makao za nyumba yeah. wana kazi yeah. na most leo ukiangalia mm. ni watu wa maderika na vitu kama wanawake mm -hmm. shida na family matters unaona yeah. unapata mtu aliwacha na bibi sababu hakuwa na pesa mm. akadesign diva ishi chini yapi sasa mimi ile kitu ningeweza kusema ni kuwa mm. kama serikali inaweza jaribu juu chini yeah. au wenye wanalala chini ya bridge mm. wasiwapige lakini watafutiwe kama ka shelter ama rehabilitation center mm. wanaezenda pale waoge mm wapate neno kidogo kama ni ya Mwenyezi Mungu kawaini wa kwenda msikitini waende kama ni wa kusoma wasome 
then watapata kubadilika then serikali waangalie jinsi wanaweza wasaidia Shukran Smith for your time I really appreciate most of my viewers are going to watch this video even the government officials are going to watch this video and I believe they are going to do something after watching this video thank you so much guys we've been lucky to get another resident who is also willing to at least tell us something small about uh, the impact of Makupa bridge yeah. to their livelihoods yeah. so kwa majina kwa majina jina ni Runi Runi Kidenji actually Tangui bridge jengwe mazee mkazi wa Mombasa mimi mkazi hapa hivi hapa Mombasa hapa tayari Tangui bridge jengwe jam sikizi hakuna hakuna stress ya kitu kama jam hiyo naweza washua alafu kitambo hapa hapa iko ngani yani red spot yani wizi kitambo kitambo hapa hivi kibarani kama ungepitia tu kidogo hivi unaporwa kila kitu manguo nini nini lakini tangui bridge jengwe sio mimi ndio efficiency ama ni jua nini kumetulia sana yani hakuna wizi kabisa hakuna wizi what else can you add i can also say that it it created it created employment for the for the locals kwa sababu tukao sisi ni mahasla mwanzia tuna ujanja sasa vile ili come through mwingi walipata chance kufanya kazi hapo na tulishukuru sana mwanze sasa tuna tuna big up serikali juu hiyo kitu sawa mwanze mwanze sawa thank you so much for your time tukuru sana kwa maoni most of my viewers wataona hii hata serikali yenyewe pia najua watafurahia at least wali create job opportunities for me sawa shukran sana for your time wipi jamaa so my name is moses i have a channel name which goes by the name of gemini tv kwanza we are very thankful to the government of kenya for making this bridge because it has really helped mombasa economically and also the people who live uh, around here so yo tumeshukuru sana i wish it was possible to pass by that place and show you mangishi but that's basically uh, it's basically shows the day this bridge was commissioned officially by the former president yeah by the former pr president these are some of the last projects that, uh, that, uh, that president did. the former president uhuru kenyatta launched yeah. or commissioned before the retirement yeah so uh, you can see infrastructure wise kenya is uh it has really is it, yeah, it is improving and uh, yeah you can't compare to some other places yeah kenya is really trying all credit to yeah. the former government so that's the old causeway it is being demolished as you can see yeah. Yeah. oh we just came at the right time guys yeah. you see the old causeway is being demolished yeah yeah and uh, i think it's more than 100 years old oh. so it has been in use for for the last 100 years So you can see this place has been beautified. On the other on the other side that was a, a dump site, the largest dump site in Mombasa. Yeah. Kibarani dump site, but now it it, it it has been it has been reformed, you can see. It's it a looks recreational beautiful. center. Yeah, it's now a recreational center. Not doing such content is not easy. It's not easy. Yeah, so In fact, the part of traveling. Traveling is expensive, <laughs> of course, yeah. Yes. So the only support I want from them is yeah. just to subscribe, like and share my videos. Yeah, so yeah. Su support her. Yeah. Let her reach 30,000 subscribers. Yeah, before the end of the year, will it be possible? Yeah, yeah, yeah it will be possible. <laughs> before the end of the year, it will be possible. Yeah. yeah. For those who did get my name well, there we go. Dolphin254. Yeah. I think they can read yeah. from my back. <laughs> yeah. As I told you, she's the she's the biggest female YouTuber doing really? constructions and uh, the such biggest? stuff. Yeah, of course. There's, <laughs> I'm there, just there's trying. No, I'm just trying. No, you're not trying. You're working hard. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have to. Yeah. And I'm planning on improving. I'm just still uh, organizing myself yeah. to get some resources to at least improve on my vlogging gears. Yeah. So next year. Inshallah, yeah, will be inshallah. a will be a big year for Dolphin to fight for because we really need to improve. Yeah, of course, of course you will. Yeah. So you yeah, support her, support me also. Yes. <laughs> yeah, so we so, are almost getting to the end of the bridge. Yeah, we almost get the end of the bridge. Yeah. Yeah. For those who don't know, this is called Makupa Bridge. Yes. Makupa Bridge, one of the best bridges I've ever seen. Yeah. By the way. Everything in Kenya to be very happy, sir. But the, these bridges are normally made by Africans. Yeah. 
Yeah. Those Chinese only give them instructions, but mm. it has really created job opportunities. Yeah. Uh, I think you heard from uh, the guy I was doing an interview. Amesema walipata job opportunities here. Walipata kuajiriwa after hustling for a very long time. Wakapata kazi. Yeah. So he was among the people who are working on this project. Yeah, so uh, the, the project created uh, job opportunities for some people. Yeah. Instead of idling. <laughs> yes. So, so the beautiful Kiba running. <laughs> so uh, this is the end of the bridge. Yes. But you can see it's not only the bridge that was, was, was built. beautified. You can also see the road. Yeah. So, so we will start from here as we go to Changamwe interchange. Because yeah. we also need to update them on the same. Yeah, yeah. So I think we'll be ending the video here. Yeah. Thank you so much. If you've enjoyed watching this video till this far, just comment down below. Tell me Dolphin254. I love your videos. Till next time. Bye-bye.